So today we're going to be talking everything about Kajabi webinar funnels, how to actually build them out, how to design them, and then how to launch your programs using Kajabi webinars. So hey there, Tim Peekman here. I am a Kajabi hero and I am a Kajabi fan. And the definition of a hero is anyone that's made at least a thousand dollars on the Kajabi platform. And this is why I've put together this program zero to Kajabi hero to walk and talk you through everything you need to know to actually get from where you are today to Kajabi hero and beyond. Before we jump into any of the training, I want to first of all, make you an offer. I wanna offer you my extended 30 day trial of Kajabi. That's over double the 14 day trial that's available to the public. You can get access, simply head on over to timpeakman.com forward slash Kajabi and create your account today. And as soon as you've done this, I will automate you a free course, Kajabi Unboxed. These are the things that you need to do immediately once you unbox your Kajabi account. And if you stick around at the end of that 30 days to become a paying member of Kajabi and know it and love it like I do, I will grant you another course. It's my sales page templates. You can just download these in a theme and then upload them into your Kajabi account. Yes, this is an affiliate link and all that means is part of your payment will come back to me in support of this channel at no extra cost to you. So that being said, let's dive straight on over into the training. Hope you enjoy. Okay, so now we're gonna look at building out a webinar funnel. Now, first off, you need to ask yourself, is a webinar funnel the right thing for you? If you are trying to sell a higher ticket or call them to action to actually book a call with you, a webinar might be a good bet for you. But I have done previous trainings on webinars. You can actually find those on my YouTube channel. But here, we're just gonna build one out from scratch and I'm gonna tell you what you actually need before you actually start to build out a webinar funnel. So in my partner's account, again, under marketing, clicking on funnels, then we're just gonna go new funnel. So it's a different way around. And then having a look at uh, which funnel it is. So let's go for a Zoom webinar funnel. You can either have a, if you're hosting it on Zoom, that's great. You can either have a, a link to a unlisted YouTube page, so you can host it on YouTube. But let's go and set up a Zoom webinar. So name your funnel, Zoom, web webinar to and then uh, i'm gonna i'm gonna sell my coaching package so zoom webinar to coaching uh, meeting link i've just gone ahead and grabbed a meeting link from my uh, zoom funnel and then webinar time let's go ahead and you really need to be planning this like a, a couple of weeks out at least so i'm going to put it in two weeks time um, and then let's say i'm going to put it in the afternoon uh, let's go for uh, let's go a little bit further in the afternoon. I'm just going to say uh, 5 p.m. And then pick a time zone. I'm going to pick a, a UK time zone because uh, that's where I am. So I'm going to either pick uh, Edinburgh or London. Let's go for London and then select an offer. So I'm going to have my, my VIP coaching. It's currently free at the moment, but um, I, can, I can change that at a later date. Create the funnel. So this has a lot of moving parts to this, but on one click, Jalby is just going to create that funnel. So it's going to create an event. It's going to create a form for the opt-in. It's going to create a bunch of emails, and then it's just going to package that up into this funnel blueprint. So if you've seen any of my funnel blueprint trainings before, you can go into each page and then edit each page and make sure that this is, this is your own, right? So uh, for a, a pre-header here, um, free online training, that, that would probably fit well for, for a webinar, save. Probably don't say the actual term webinar on a webinar training, either say masterclass, web class, workshop, anything like that, free training works fine. But once I've edited this page, I can then go back out um, and then go into the actual event. So Kajabi's created this event and it's gonna give you some event actions uh, it's going to go, this is the actual event here, and then it's going to give you some emails pre and post. And it's give you, going to give you a bunch of copy as well, so you can actually go in and then just edit this copy and just point to note here, don't edit the uh, the time here. It's, it's giving you a code that will actually just um, say the event time in a local um, local time zone. So go through these emails and then edit them to you. Kajabi gives you a good steer on what you should be talking about. And then it's just trying to promote the webinar. 
Your registrations will end up here. So you can see the number of registrations. They're actually opting in to your registration page. So this remember is your registration page. And then by creating this webinar funnel, you would have actually created another form. Then going onto the sales page, this is probably one of the most important pieces. This is what you're gonna be directing them to after you delivered the webinar. So in a couple of weeks time, deliver the webinar on Zoom and then send them over to this offer page, whether it is via QR code or say, go to this link, then they're gonna actually be taking this offer page through to the checkout. So which is gonna be the VIP coaching. If you are um, sharing this funnel link, you've gone through and edited all these, Kajabi will give you a share funnel link. All you need to do is share that funnel link and then everyone will actually see the first thing you have here. Even if you reorder them, you could have um, a registration page now, but then you could have like the replay page. You could add, actually build in another page here. If you wanted to, you can go ahead and actually add in another sales page. So if I was going back into the Zoom webinar coaching, I wanted to add in another page here. You can just add page. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add an existing landing page. So we've drawn up a template that we've used before going into the landing page. It's this Encore theme. I'm gonna save that. It's gonna pull through this landing page from my landing pages and then it's gonna be just in here as the sales page. So it's a little bit more uh, of a in detail sales page with all of the actions here so then you can build this out so that's a little trick there it's going to actually pull that through from the landing pages and onto here you can actually go back out and then go into your website and then remember going into pages and then going into the funnels so from here we've got the zoom webinar to coaching you can edit all your pages in here just like a normal page editor and then just remember to actually click the edit details because if you are sharing any of these you've got to give it a, a specific title make sure that the the url is nice and easy to say and then actually build out the page title and page description if you are using it for seo and sharing so you can do all of the editing through here uh, in inside the funnel builder but to get back to the actual funnel blueprint you go marketing and then you go to funnels but i'm just going to show you the forms and the event that it's actually built out. So if you wanted to go to events, this is the new Zoom webinar to coaching that they've built out for you. This is going into forms. This is the new Zoom webinar to coaching form. And just a word of warning, when you're actually counting the number of form submissions, it might be different to the number of event registrations. So someone might opt in twice and it will show like two opt-ins on the form submission, but actually go to the events and then go into the event and then click on registrations. That will give you the exact amount of people who have registered for the event. And then lastly, then going back into funnels to check out the funnel blueprint once more, back into the funnel blueprint. You can edit until your heart's content. These are the stats that you should be paying attention to. So how many people hit the registration page, um, the confirmation page, which is a thank you page for the registration, the sales page, and then your VIP coaching. As I've put a second sales page in here, I would probably go down to the template sales page and just remove that. Remove that from the funnel and just use my sales page. So once you're happy with this, you can copy this link and then share that to your audience and then just track as they're going through your funnel, deliver the webinar and then actually get them onto that sales page and promote your offer. So that's it. Hopefully you found value in this training and you got something out of it and you managed to implement something. If you haven't done already, claim your free account. That link once more, head to timpeatman.com forward slash Kajabi and look for that free mini course that I'll be granting you. Check your spam if it's not there. And if you are progressing past that 30 days and you become a paying member like me, just reach out to me, Tim, at timpeatman.com and I'll grant you that second mini course which involves the sales page templates so you can just download them and upload them into your Kajabi account. And I look forward to seeing you on another video soon.